Good evening and welcome to this very special edition of The Hot Seat. I'm Nidhi Razdan. Well, the general elections are finally over. And in this landmark election, the big buzzword has been youth and the Rahul Gandhi phenomenon. Joining me on the program tonight are two first-time MPs from the Congress Party who are hoping to make a difference in this Lok Sabha. One of them is Vijinder Singla, the MP from Sangrur. And the baby of the house, as he's called, at the age of just 26, Hamdullah Saeed, the MP from Lakshadweep. Thank you both very much for joining Thank us on the hot seat today. First time MPs, let me ask both of you, is it exciting or is it daunting? Very yeah, exciting. I'm very delighted. I'm very delighted and I, uh, first of all, take this opportunity to express my uh, gratitude and thanks to the people of Lakshadweep who have reposed their faith, who have reposed their confidence in me, and I hope I come up to their expectations. You're not scared at all, a little anxious, nervous? What is there to be anxious and nervous? <laughs> what about you? Even I am very thrilled, you know, and I feel very uh, happy that I am here after a long tenure, long hard work for the organization, which I was doing in Punjab, and now I'm, I would like to work and serve the people of my area. You don't think it's daunting that now you're an MP, you're a no. member of parliament, there's One, responsibility? Yeah, that is there. I feel it's a big responsibility towards the people of my area who have made me, who have got me elected and sent me to the parliament. And obviously on whatever issues I have promises I have made during the election process, I have to come up to their expectations. And obviously that obviously honks your mind, but otherwise I am thrilled. Let me ask both of you, uh, uh, Hamdullah, let me ask you first, what do you think the Congress's surprise uh, success in this election is owed to well, and your own success? See, as far as my own success is concerned, uh, uh, during the last Lok Sabha election, <laughs> my father, has, Mr. P.M. Said, has been representing Lakshadweep right from 1967 up till 2004. Ten Lok Sabha elections he won consecutively from Lakshadweep. 1967 was a year when Lakshadweep was declared as a parliamentary constituency. In 2004, he lost for want of 71 votes from Dr. Koya, who was a JDU so candidate. You, so you admit uh, your family's... Uh background and past, your political background uh, helped a, a great Of course deal. it does help, it, mm. it, up to a certain extent it does help, but at the end of the day you have to prove your mettle, if mm. you are able enough, if you are capable enough, if you are efficient, only then you can survive and sustain. Well, why did the party do so well? Before I come to the question of dynasty, why did the party do so well in this election? Nobody thought the Congress was going to get 206 seats. I'll tell you, the party has done well because of the policies of the UPA, because of the vision of Rahul Gandhi towards the youngsters of this country. The way the organizational elections had started as a pilot project from Punjab, in which we were able to tap the youngsters who were attaining an age of 18, getting them enrolled as members of the Youth Congress, whether it started from Punjab, went up to Gujarat and Damandiu and Lakshwadeep and so on, and which is going to go on to other states. So what is happening is today the youth of this country are feeling that earlier whatever they used to work at the grassroots level, which their work used to get unnoticed. Today their strength, their work, their hard work at the ground level is the, is the thing which is giving them positions in the party. So, so you and think it's Rahul's policy that's, that's been largely uh, responsible for policy, the Congress's win? Uh, I feel the, his policy, his vision for this India, the vision, uh, his vision for the party, vision for the youngsters of this country and obviously the UPA's policies, maybe the RTI, maybe the loan waiver scheme or the NREGS, 100 days of committed work to every household in this country the uh, uh, Rozgar Yojana, uh, as you call in Hindi, and obviously the biggest factor was what we did for the poor people, Swastha Bhima Yojana scheme in which every household of this country was given 30,000 rupees of free insurance. So it was, it's a clubbing of the Rahulji's factor, Rahulji's vision towards the tapping the youth as well as the UPS policy for this country. Now